OFW, welcome po dito sa channel ko. Mga YouTubers, subscribers, and followers, welcome po kayo dito. Alam nyo ba na ang Saudi Arabia kung anong year sila ngayon dito? Ang year nila ngayon dito ay 1441. Uh, Bis po sa searching ko sa calendar era, Wikipedia, nag-search po ako. In modern calendar, we level all years before Christ. OBC or or ED ano Domini or in the year of our Lord there is no zero. Calendar era is a year numbering system by use by a calendar. Example nito yung Islamic calendar 1440 to 1441 count years before Christ. So ibig sabihin pala yung kali a uh, year natin na uh, 2019 kung ibabasi po sa calendar era ito po tayo ay nasa before Christ. Alright, dito na po tayo. Ang tatalakayin ko po ngayon is all about the culture of Saudi Arabia. Uh, Saudi Arabia is a cultural city greatly influenced by the Arab and Islamic culture. Ang society nila ay generally deeply religious. So, per sila ka mga religyoso yung mga tao dito conservative, uh, traditional and family oriented. Many and attitudes and traditions are uh, traditions are centuries old derived from the Arab civilization and Islamic heritage. That of what affected sila sa mabilisang pagbabago or rapid change. As the country was transformed from the impoverished nomadic society into a rich commodity producer in just a few years. Ito yung mga kasuotan ng mga lalaki dito sa Saudi Arabia. Saudi men and boys, kahit na nasa trabaho sila or in a social status sila, ito yung suot nila, traditional dress. Tube or tube. Tinatawag nilang Arabic Arabic dress. Uh, sa panahon ng warm and hot, Saudi men and boys wear white robes. At sa panahon naman ng cold o taglamig, nagsusuot sila ng wool tops and the uh, in the dark color. And for the special occasion, men are often wear vest or mishla over the top long white, brown, or black clocks trimmed in yellow. They were at a special occasions like weddings and special gatherings. Ito naman ang tawag sa nilalagay sa ulo nila. Means headdress consists of three things. Tajia uh, Tajia, Gotra, and the Ijal. Tadi, tajia is a small white cap that keeps the gotra from the sleeping of pag tanggalin nila yung kanilang gotra ang ipapalit nila yung tajia the gotra which is a gotra is a traditional cafe large square of cloth made of cotton traditional is either white or red stripe The gutra is worn folded into a triangle and centered on the head. The eagle is for a double black cord that holds the gutra in place. Wearing of eagle is a considered a sign of pity. Pity means religious. Saudi women wearing a niqab and hijab and riyadh. Under Saudi law, women are required to wear an abaya, but niqab and hijab is optional. O kung pwede lang pala na abaya lang yung isuot, okay na yung hijab or niqab. Niqab is also called a roban. It's a garment clothing that covers the face. Hijab is a head covering scarf that some Muslim women wear in public. Abaya, a sign of respect, dignity, modesty, and easy and convenient way to hide the body according to Islamic teaching. 
Daily life is dominated by Islamic observance five times it's the Muslim called to prayer. Friday is a holiest day for Muslims. Weekend, Friday, and Saturday. In accordance to with uh, Wahhabi doctrine, two, only two religious holidays called uh, Eid Al-Fitr and El Adha. Eid Al-Fitr, ito yung isang banal na buwan ng pag-aayuno, ang Ramadan. Ang Eid ay isang salitang Arabic na may ibig sabihin na masayang kapistahan. Ang Eid Al-Adha, El Adha, ito ang pagdiriwang sa sakripisyo o mas malaking Eid. September 23, National Holiday, which commemorates the unification of the kingdom. is a chance to spend time with friends and family and reflect on their country's progress as well as on their hopes for the future. There are many limitations and prohibitions on behavior and dress which are strictly enforced both legally and socially often when so there in the other Muslim countries. So marami na palang mga uh, gumagawa ng ipinagbabawal sa iba't ibang countries. However, many of the traditional restrictions have been left recently by the government including allowing women to drive. On the other hand, things prohibited by Islam are banned in the country. Example, yung mga alcoholic, beverages are strictly prohibited. So, wala nang inom-inom. Ipinagbabawal talaga dito sa Saudi Arabia yung mga inumin. mga nakakalasing, mga alcohol. They have also non-religious holidays, September 23. Saudi Arabia has two mainly seasons, summer and winter. Summer 2020 in the Northern Hemisphere will begin on June 21, Sunday, and ends on September 22, Tuesday. When 2019 in Northern Hemisphere will begin on December 22, Sunday, and ends on March 20, 2020, Friday. July is the hottest month in Riyadh, with an average temperature of 96 degrees Fahrenheit or 36 degrees Celsius. At the coldest is January at 59 Fahrenheit degrees or 15 Celsius degrees. with the most daily sunshine hours at 11 and July. Alright, dito muna magtatapos po ang aking learning, searching, and knowing. Sana po ay may natutunan kayo sa aking, pa, aking searching ngayong araw na to. Don't forget to subscribe, click the like, and sa, click the bell button. para may update ko kayo sa susunod ko pong video. Thank you so much po sa pag-subscribe at sa pakikinig. God bless!